like we are. Okay! Alright, so I want to do one more level tonight. So let's load this up. Pause that sucker. It's up to you to set up the most efficient and cost effective hospital possible. The people around here are pretty well off, so fleece them for as much dosh as you can. Remember, curing people is all very nice, but you really need the money it brings. Take these six people, sick people to the cleaners. Amass a whopping thirty, three hundred thousand dollars to complete this level. Well, let me see what the other uh, conditions are. Uh, Fifty-five percent treat rate, four hundred treated. Okay, stuff that'll come relatively easily. Let's take a look at the. Uh, the map. This is looking good. I like this. So I'll probably expand this way first, but let's start out. Uh, so this is clearly the entrance. Is that where the helipad is? It's over here. Yeah, it's close enough. So I'll drop reception right here. Let's put it there. Let's get a good receptionist. Is good. I like it. I like it. And then I think I'll just do. I'll have a, a a row of offices and whatnot going down this way, and then more stuff in the middle. So there's going to be a hallway here, and then probably one there. That feels like a good way of setting this up. No, ah. Okay, there's that, there's that, and that. And at some point I might start thinking about... Uh, pharmacy is always good. At some point I might start thinking about altering how much I'm charging for things, which I can do from the casebook. I can change the treatment charge there. Although the treatment charge naturally goes up, I think it goes up with reputation. It may go up with uh, the individual treatments. Not totally sure. Like how many times each thing has been treated. So at this point, I'll just get a normal doctor. I'm not going to worry about getting a researcher. Ooh, that's a good one. Okay. Um. Okay, cardiogram, I think, fits in the same size room. Yeah, it does. So there's that and that. Get these going. Okay. Yeah, fine, I'll pick up one of the researchers. The decent one. Okay. Oh, so this is the limit of the map, it looks like. That's cool. I'm cool with that. Um, so nothing else is going to be this small, although that's a decent size. Is that a good ward size? It is. Efficient use of space is what I am all about. Um, that's probably a bad place for it. I want to get as many beds in here as possible, so three is reasonable, I guess. There's that. Let's hire another nurse. Get a slightly cheaper one. Nope. Alright. So that's looking good. I think I want to have... Um, so I'm going to want to put the operating theater here. And then I think I want a corridor here. Oh, whoops. So let's see. If I put the operating theater there, it comes out to the same place. Good to know. Good to know. So general diagnosis, probably. So if this comes out to the same place, I should probably start it about here. Hopefully that corridor is big enough that people won't glitch out as they have in the past. Let's throw a radiator there. What? What? 
drop a radiator there. Oops. Get some benches. I don't think I'm going to have to worry about people waiting to get through reception, but I should probably keep benches there just in case. So there's the general diagnosis and psychiatric. Oh, except I need a psychiatrist. Didn't plan that one out, did I? Um, but that, I think, is a, a pretty decent setup, at least initially. Let's up the heat a little. Yeah. I think this will be good. Put a radiator on this wall. Try to keep things nice and toasty. And I'm going to go ahead and open. So there's not any space here for anything. Might as well drop a few benches there, then. I think I'm going to stick... Since I know that I'm going to be expanding out this way, I think my plan is to put the staff room right here. Maybe make it nice and long. This way... Actually, let me put the door there, so it's a little bit easier for people from those expansions to get to. Pool table, bunch of sofas. My normal operating procedure here. Nice. That looks good. And again, sticking with the general plan of having benches in every single hallway. So let's up the speed a little bit. We are in February, which means I should have new hires. So there are a couple surgeons and a guy who does everything. I'm going to get the guy who does everything and then just hold off for a while. Should probably get a handyman. He's a good one. What am I at? I'm at 42,000 still. It's kind of a lot of money. Um, let's see how far back this will go. If I'm doing that operating theater, this might be enough room for a research facility and some toilets? Maybe? The research department is an important one. Is that too far forward? No. So to have all of these at the same depth, I guess. Auto-autopsy, there's that, and that. Can I get another desk in here? I can. So I could have two dudes working. Uh, put in another filing cabinet? Why not? Okay. Now I wonder if I can get a... Okay, that'll work. A guy who could be a psychiatrist. I'm, I'm happy with that. No. I don't think that that's wide enough for a toilet, unfortunately. Uh, send them home. Send them home. I could, in principle, I could send them to the research department, but it won't let me do that. That looks pretty good. I'm liking that. Um, right, right, right. I need heat on that side of the building. Why are they coming in over here? Because they're terrible people. That's why. Okay, so... There's a lot of space here. I could put... Okay, emergency. One person with golf stones. Can I get another surgeon? I can. Okay. Keep the piles we know about, sleeping illness we know about. Since I brought in somebody who needs surgery, I'm just gonna build the operating theater. I might do this, though. To try to make optimal use of 
space. Get over there. Got it. Let's put a drinks machine up against that wall. Yeah, see? Perfect. That's beautiful. So I can get... Um... This isn't going to be big enough to get three, is it? No. So I could put one there, one facility there, and then maybe a toilet right there. If I tried to put it down here... Oh, I could put the toilet there. That might, that might be the best place for it, actually. So, let's get that going. Similar sort of deal. Just in case, I always get way more toilets than I'm ever going to need. Okay, saved him. Awesome. Well done, me. Um, I feel like... In the past... Uh... Killing people with drugs has been one of my biggest problems. So I am going to focus almost exclusively on that. The specialization just because I want to be able to deal with new new problems. Jeez. I wish there were a better way to do that. <clears throat> so this I'm liking this setup. It's not exactly what I had envisioned, or what I had hoped for, because there's a lot of empty space here, there's a lot of empty space there, but maybe... Maybe that's better, you know? Maybe that's better. Oh, there was already a guy in there. Fine, whatever. I am going to need that inflation clinic right away, because there's a guy with bloody head. On his way. Fire extinguisher, radiator... Bam. Can I put... That seems good. Yes. I will gladly invite a VIP. I'm also gladly going to hire another handyman and give this guy the express job of dealing with equipment because I really don't want things to explode again. I really feel like diagnosing bloaty head should be a lot easier than this. I don't see why they need to get on a treadmill. Baldness too. Why is that guy... I, I don't know. Corrugated ankles. That's fine. So I think, at this point, I have one of everything? Is that right? Yeah. Yeah, I do. I have one of everything, so it might be, depending on how busy we get, it might be worth putting another GP's office and pharmacy in this area. But it's nice having that uh, freedom there. Ah. All right. Don't know what to do, send them home. I don't want people dying in my hospital. Yeah, and I need to start making money. I've spent a lot. Pregnant. Good. Good. Unexpected swelling. Excellent. So, is he a surgeon? No. He's a psychiatrist. Send him off. Attending psychiatry, please. 
25 people come through? Not bad. Ooh, Harryitis. Haven't seen that one. Yet. You can see that hairy dude right there. Okay, let's go up to max speed for a minute. Okay. Five people with fractured bones. You know what? I can handle that. VIP was satisfied. Let's send them home. We don't know what to do with them. Get rid of them. I can't. I don't know what you want from me. How are we doing? Everybody's happy, generally speaking. Send them home. Let's. Oh, oh, oh my! I didn't realize that I had some space here that didn't have stuff. Looks like we succeeded on that, yeah. Extra thousand bucks. Nice. I like it. Let's go to... Oh, killed my first person. That's unfortunate. One person with broken heart. I have the equipment and skills to be able to handle it. I don't think I've just discovered Broken Heart yet, but... Okay, good. The emergency takes precedence. Got the cure. Excellent. This is Discovering Broken Heart. No. Oh. Interesting. Yeah, so I definitely have more doctors than I need. That's okay. Oops. Uh, eighty-two percent chance. Let's take a risk. Let's take a chance on that. Serious radiation. I can't deal with. That was the end of the year that I just blew through accidentally. This queue is huge, so I think it is officially time for a second GP's office. Which is good, because I had a bunch of doctors who were just standing around there for a long time. Killed somebody again. Jeez. Infectious laughter, you know about that. Discreet itching caused by tiny insects with sharp teeth. Symptoms are scratching, leading to body part inflammation. The patient drinks a pharmaceutical gluey syrup to prevent the skin from itching. That sounds good. Yes. Send them home. I don't want people dying in my hospital. There's another death, though. Broken wind. Okay. Is everybody decently happy? Yeah. Doing pretty well. Gastric ejections caused by spicy Mexican or Indian food. The half-digested food is emitted from the patient in random clusters. <laughs> oh, jeez. Drinking a special binding solution prevents anything being ejected. Interesting. Hairyitis. All right. Prolonged exposure to the moon causes it naturally. Sufferers experience enhanced sense of smell. I feel like that's not the only symptom given, you know, the really hairy dudes there. An electrolysis machine removes the hair and seals up the pores. Sounds good. Send to the research department so we can figure out how to electrolysize them. Earthquakes, man. All my stuff's okay? It looks like all my stuff's okay. Send them to research. Five people with gut rot. I think I can handle that. 
Uh, where's gut rot? Gut rot. 85%? Yeah, we need to make that better. My auto autopsy of machine has been discovered. Great. Okay, nurse is getting there. Send that patient home, send that patient home. Killed one. Okay, I only killed one. Still got a thousand. A thousand bucks out of it. It's not bad. I like it. How's the queue here? There's three. And then there's one here. Is that right? Yeah. What's this woman waiting for? No, just get out of my hospital. I don't want you dying here. Okay. VIP was happy. That's my reputation. Terrible. Drop down below 400. That's okay, though. Do I know how to cure any of these other things? No. I did take research off of everything. <laughs> Send them home. I don't understand why people. Are, what are you waiting for? Operating theater. Yeah. Jeez. Two people with baldness can't treat it. As much as I would love to. I'm gonna need another operating theater. It looks like. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna have. Relatively soon, I'm gonna have to get another operating theater. How's the pharmacy going? Nobody's in line, so. I don't quite need another one of those. So we got five there, we've got four here. That's that's acceptable. Get out of here. I can't I can't cure it. I I don't have a thing to cure hairyitis. So there's no guessing on a possible cure. It's just uh, I've killed a lot of people. Jeez. Okay, send them home. Send them home. There's my reputation. Reputation is holding at around 380. It's acceptable, I guess. What are you waiting for? I don't even know. Is this... Psychiatry? Oh, I need another psychiatrist's office. No, did I accept that? I hope I didn't. Oh man. Kidney stones, I can do that. I think I need another psychiatrist. If I put that here. And throw a radiator. Send this guy home. He has hairyitis. I can't deal with that. Lower the speed a little bit. Serious radiation? Yeah, you're getting researched. Okay. 
So I should have a psychiatrist somewhere. He's a researcher psychiatrist. There. That'll do. This woman is almost dead. Get out of my hospital. I am ruthless. Oh. Awesome. End of your bonuses. I lost a bunch of reputation. That's one of the worst things I could possibly lose. It's going to get worse before it's going to get better. Alright? Not a big deal. Okay. I'm going to reduce this. And maybe put 10 into that and 10 into this. And then 10 into the other one, I guess. There. I could probably fit one more facility in here. Serious radiation. To the Slack tongue, I can't deal with. Ah! I can start dealing with radiation poisoning, though. How the hell are you supposed to get this to work? <laughs> okay, so the door was in a bad place. I got that and that. Seems good to me. Fire extinguisher there. Can I put a radiator behind this thing? No. Well, the VIP was happy. Okay, I think. I think that's okay. Probably need another doctor though. Ah, oh, jeez. Get that guy. Uh, nine people with infectious laughter. I think we can handle that. I have two psychiatry. I'm gonna hire another. Surgeon, just so that I have it. Well, Harryitis, send him to research. Did I get them all? I got them all. $18,000 bonus. Fantastic. Okay, how many people have gone through there? 19. I guess it's really not that many. Okay. Doing it. Let's get moving. 85%? Sure. Okay. Things that I need. Um, I need another GP's office. At least one. Um, I might even just put two in here. I don't know. What else... What else is there? Is this... So it's not... It doesn't have a long queue. Pharmacy doesn't have much of a queue. I've, I now have two psychiatrists. So that's not a big deal. It's really just GP. That... I have need of. 
So what if I do this and sort of have a hallway around the outside and then kind of fill in this corner? That seems reasonable. Another GP's office. Looks good to me. Fill the hallways with benches. Actually, let's put a radiator there. Oops, wrong one. Nope, not a plant. Where did I pull the bench? There. Okay. Okay. So there's another. There's another place there. Um. What is the most important treatment facility? Pharmacy is pretty high up there. So maybe I'll put another pharmacy right next to this. No. If I'm going to put a pharmacy, I should put it there. Yeah. So that I have more room. So that I could put a bigger, a bigger uh, facility right there. That's the, the hope, at least. Yeah, so. Should probably hire another nurse. I guess, I guess she'll work. I can't deal with Harryitis. So this, I mean, not ideal, but it's working. People are thirsty! Good! That's... That's a problem that I don't mind working on. Boom! Get some drinks! Can't deal with slack tongue. I killed somebody when I took their cast off. That's cool. Two people with spare ribs? I can totally do that. We're big enough that I think I'm going to go for another handyman just to make sure that this is as clean as possible. Send this dude home. Research department. Bring the VIP in. Send that person home. Send that person home. Let's make sure that nothing exploded. It doesn't look like anything exploded. Slack tongue, I don't know how to deal with it. Ooh, this is going to be close. Because the surgeons took a long time getting there. Get out of my hospital. Get out of my hospital. All these people keep showing up and I don't have facilities to treat them. Okay. Success. Took care of the kidney beans or whatever it was. So, why is there a reception queue? Alright. Alright, everything's positive this time. Good. Another year down. 310 reputation. As long as I stay above 300, I think I'm going to be safe. Because I can build that back up by just curing people. A lot of people. What is what is his deal? He's got golf stones. Is he at the front of the queue? He is at the front of the queue. Good. Doctor, 
Oh, how's this? How's the drug research going? Let's just go through and look at everything. Corrugated ankles and broken winds are both 85, 90, 85, 95. Uh, let's concentrate research on hairyitis. Keep piles. 85, 90 for the squits, 85 for uncommon cold. I've spent all this time focused on uh, unexpected swelling. We should, should be able to handle that. Alright, announcements. You need to shut up. That is much better. So I've got plenty of money. My reputation's okay. I need to cure 250 more people. 240 more people. Slicer. Got it. Ooh, and electrolysis. I can do both. So, electrolysis here, I guess? Fire extinguisher in that corner. Patients with hairyitis are directed to this room where a special machine called an electrolyzer yanks out the hairs and seals the pores electrically using a compound not unlike grout. It requires a doctor. Uh, take a chance. Let's drop a radiator there. And... Get a crappy doctor. Send this guy home. Um... I want to guess at 80, I want to send home at the same place. I just killed a person with hairyitis. Awesome. I am an excellent hospital administrator. Oh no. Get in there, finish the job. Oh, that was close. Okay. Whew. I need another surgeon. I really wish I could hire another surgeon. Oh, I only lost one of them, I guess. Didn't realize. 306. I'm not exactly excited about that. Oh no, lots of people are gonna die. Oh man, you get out of here. Um, and somebody did just die, it looks like. So there's a dude and a chick. Dude, get out. Chick, get out. Whew. That was close. Oh, slack tongue, right. I want to be able to treat that. Seems like a worthwhile investment. We just under 300, just by 17. Yuck. How we doing on GPQs? Fine, really. Okay. We're warm. We're not thirsty. The person who's about to die needs to get out. That person's getting pretty close. They should get out too. 
gonna get the VIP because as long as it goes well, I should get a reputation boost out of it. I need another surgeon. I need another surgeon. Bad. There we go. Okay. Let's see. Oops. Gonna put a little staff room over here. That unfortunately is only gonna have sofas. No pool table. As much as I would love one. And then let's put a radiator against this wall like that. Where's my reputation? 273. Okay, we're holding stable. More or less. Okay, killed somebody. It's gonna drop the reputation a bit. That's okay. Not a huge deal. Let's just put these back at even. So that maybe... Maybe focusing on drugs was not the right idea. Not the right move. Good, 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 good. We can start curing some slack, Tom. That should be easy money. Okay, boldness. Send him to the research department. Invisibility is bad. Okay, I need to I need to change this around. Guess at the cure at 90 again. And just automatically send him home if less than that. Seems good. Transparency, good. King complex, good. Alright, things are going pretty well now. Things are looking up. Things are looking up. Except for all those people who just died. Back down to 270. I need to start panicking if I drop below 250. Oh good, 285. Awesome. Hopefully the end of year bonuses will, will push me up a bit. Okay, it was a fine, it was not a reputation hit. What was a fine for? Very poor reputation. Okay. What is it? Sweaty palms, we can do that. I have two uh, psychiatrist offices. As long as the psychiatrists actually go there. Where are my psychiatrists? I guess I can look here, can't I? You are not a psychiatrist, neither are you. No, no, yes. You are performing surgery. Fine. You are really tired. Do I really only have two psychiatrists? Oh, jeez, I'm in a terrible... I'm in a terrible place. As soon as this guy's done... As soon as this procedure is over... Come on, go. Beautiful. Yes, fine, you get a raise. I don't care. Good, got them all. That should have been a reputation boost. 293, I like where that is going. That trend is one that I like. I guess I need to hire another psychiatrist if I can. It's a new month. Okay. Well, aside from the fact that I might fail from having really low reputation, everything else is going pretty well. And I can now build an x-ray, so that's pretty sweet. Uh, I'm at 61% treating. Ugh. 
That might might get tricky. I need 142 more cures and a lot of other stuff. So let's invite the VIP. Jeez, people keep dying. Go put that there. Of course. Radiators, of course. Okay. I like that. How am I doing? 278. That's okay. How many times has this been used? 92? Let's replace it. Should probably worry about doing that a lot sooner. I'm thinking 40 is probably the place where I want to start replacing things. So, I think we're good. Right, look for psychiatrists. No, not black. Research departments. Okay. It's all the same stuff. I can't believe that I only have two psychiatrists. <sighs> what am I doing with my life? What am I doing with their lives? Okay, VIP liked it. We're at 280. We're still above 250. It's not climbing, unfortunately, but we are holding steady, which is better than nothing. Can I look just at deaths? Cures and deaths. Uh, let's go over years. Reputation is taking a dive. Deaths have been pretty constant, so have cures. Over the year, the increase. Ten people with transparency. Let's give it a shot. It's probably going to hurt my reputation when a bunch of them die, but... Yeah, we killed one, at least. Killed two, probably. Okay, how was it? Nine of ten! Excellent. 293 reputation. Okay, GP's offices are getting packed again. So, it is about that time. It is about that time. Okay. Bad reputation, so I got fined again. I'm just gonna make a giant GP's office. I don't even care, man. Oh, jeez, they're all coming here. Oh, jeez, how long is the queue? It's huge! I wish they wouldn't just all run to... Oh, oh do I know how to treat baldness now? I do. 
get a big ball in this room. Whatever. Okay. Look for psychiatrists. Surgeon will work. Invite the VIP. Where am I at? Reputation 274. That's okay. Um, GP's office? Yes. And let's just hire another doctor. For that, fine. Yeah. This is rough. How we doing? He gets good. They're overall pretty happy though. Even though a lot of people are dying and the reputation's really low. That's why the reputation's low, I guess, is because a huge number of deaths. You get out of my hospital. I should do that. I should People who are just going to die in the halls, I should go do a sweep every now and then and just kick them all out. This guy with bloaty head that, for some reason, hadn't been diagnosed. Get out of here. Oh, jeez. 253. Reputation's taking some pretty hard hits here. Yes! Another psychiatrist. Thank God. Okay. This guy needs to go. This guy needs to go. Whew. Okay. What do I need to do? What do I need to do to keep from losing more reputation? Kick people out. That'll work, I think. Or does the process of kicking people out lower my reputation? I don't even know, man. It looks like it does. Okay, so I'm not going to kick people out anymore. But people are dying, and it's terrible. What do I need? We've had 57 people go through there. 109 go through there. So maybe I get another cardio? I'll open up this wing. Yeah. I should probably put a radiator back here somewhere. Good. Open up this wing. Get another cardio going. I think that's bigger than it needs to be. Yeah. Another cardio. That's gonna work for me, I think. I hope. Let's put some benches on the other side as well. Maybe get a drinks machine going. Seems good to me. People are dying, but 239. <laughs> as long as I don't lose any more, I think I'll be okay. Um. So my GP's offices are acceptable, I guess? There's not a really long wait for these. So I think that's going to go... that's going to be okay. Uh, yeah, for now that's going to be fine. Let's make sure that I have another doctor on staff. Right, I'm not kicking people out, even if they're going to die, because that's bad business. Apparently. I think I think it's time to invest in another operating theater. And I'm going to do that over here. So, here's the ward.
and then another operating theater. Bench it up. Looks good. Okay. Um, need to make sure that I've got surgeons, though. I know I have a bunch of surgeons on staff, but... Let's put another staff room. Nope, that's not gonna work. Alright, so this hallway is dead to me. It's just space that I have to heat. That's fine. Whatever. Get a GP's office, maybe? No, I don't need another GP's office. Ah! Freaking myself out here. 238. I can't handle any more of a... Ah, any more of a uh, reputation drop. Will kill me. Get rid of that. Go. Get out of here. No! Ah! I told myself I wasn't going to do that! Five people with unexpected swelling. I do have two... Two things for that. I probably should get another handyman, since I'm seeing some vomit around. I'm going to get another... I am going to get another staff room. And maybe another toilet down here. The VIPs love me, though. I don't know why. I don't know what they see in it, but... Their reputation is still in the toilet, so... So there's that. Let's get some toilets. Um, just do it here. It doesn't have to make sense. I'm not worried about it making sense. Um, yeah, and somebody went right in there. Straight to the toilet. Fantabulous. How's my emergency going? Terribly. Um, um, get in there. You need to rest, unfortunately. Uh... You're a surgeon. I don't care that there was somebody in there. Oh man, this emergency just failed miserably. Oh! Yeah, I'm screwed. So, emergency failed. That was bad. My reputation is decent, though. On the bright side. I... The announcements are starting to get to me. How are we doing on... GP's offices? They look good. They look good. People are happy, generally so, yeah. If I get more hospital value, I don't know if I'll win with this being red. But I should probably try it. So, buy that. That should push me up over the edge on all of them. Yeah. So we'll see at the end of the year if that'll do it. Or if I need to get my reputation up. Cure equipment is researched to 100%. Does that mean that I have something new? No. No, it doesn't. Fine. We're almost there. Is this good enough? It was. Okay. Fantastic. Alright. I will accept the promotion, and then I'm going to call it a night. 
I'll try to pick this up later. Let's 